fortune in diamonds in this vault, and it's about to be ours. We got lots of cash. We got so much cash. Mm -hmm. We're just barfing cash. Blah. Harley. You say something, Red? Girl, I can't hear the tumblers if you're singing. Sorry, it won't happen again. Better not. <laughs> Shh. I wasn't singing, I was humming. Find something else to do with your mouth other than yap. Rhymes with rich. If I hear one more sound out of you, just one, I swear I'll cram fast for and cast the seeds up your tuckers! <laughs> Not one sound. Got it. You want to sing now, Harley girl? You go right ahead and sing. Harley, you were supposed to be watching. Didn't you see them come in? Sure I did, Red. So why didn't you say something? <coughs> Last year. It took me three years to track down the Jade Gato, and three more to figure out how to steal it. Funny, it only took me ten minutes to figure out how to snatch it back. Okay then, you take it. Admiring the view? Now that was nice. I really want that cat. What's so special about the Jade Puss anyway? It's supposed to have powerful mystical properties. Brings good luck, long life, the usual. Oh, and it is worth three million bucks. Help me back up. Cat first. Can't do it. Can't let you win this one. Looks like a draw to me. I don't get the cat. But you don't get me. Huh. Some draw. Hell of a good luck charm you turned out to be. Long life, my... Whoa. Now would be a good time for one of those mystical power... Whoa! Well, hello, sweetie. Where'd you come from? At least I won't be going home empty-handed. I've never seen a cat with your coloring. Oh, you're just precious. The only thing that would make this day more perfect would be if I had that jade gato in my lap. But we can't have everything, can we? Huh? Gotcha. Home. Halloween is amateur night, Harl. When everyone and her sister parades around in a costume, it's not for pros like you and me. Uh, maybe, but me and Mr. J used to do it a big. <laughs> You're not going to cry on me now, are you? Oh, Mr. J! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, stop bawling, or I won't give you your Halloween present. Present? By the door. Real villains? You did it! Oh, Red! Uh. My schnookums! This is the bestest Halloween 
treat I could have got. But I didn't get nothing for you, Red. Not necessary. Yeah, necessary. Don't go nowhere. I'll be right back. Oy vey. Still gotta find something for Red, though. And I think I just did! This is the bestest Halloween treat I could've got! But I didn't get nothing for you, Red. Not necessary. Yeah, necessary. Don't go nowhere. I'll be right back. Oy vey. Yes, this is perfect. Still gotta find something for Red, though. And I think I just did. Good. Nice Harley. I'm touched, really. But I think you made a mistake. You don't like it? <coughs> Ow! What? Who'd have thought? Batgirl? A guy? I'm Batgirl. Hey, great show, Z. Can I call you a cab? No, it's a nice night. I'll walk. Okay, cutes. Hand over your money and no one gets hurt. Gee, how can I resist an offer like that? Nug, Makib, Kane. Whoa! Better than pepper spray. <gasps> Kurt tilts me. Ooh! Watch it, pal. People are walking here. Whoa, you tell them, legs. Yeah, what's your hurry, hot stuff? Listen, fellas, it's been a long night, and I want to go home, okay? Great. I don't think so. Hey! Look at me. I'm Abe Lincoln. Give it back! Over here, Mama! Here you go, Chicky. That's it. Scredge, Maki Stoat! <laughs> Sorry, boys. No one touches the hat. That ain't good. Retall sounds right! Evening, Jonesy. Good heavens, Miss Satana. Don't you know it's dangerous for a young lady to walk alone in the city after dark? It's a wonder you made it home safely. 
I guess I just live right. All three of us want it, but only one of us can steal it. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. Halt! The museum is closed. Boingy boingy. What? Boingy boingy. What did you say? Boingy boingy. Boingy boingy. <coughs> Rock, Rock, paper, paper scissors. scissors. Halt. Bless you. What? <sighs> We'd be gone. Ah. Rock, Rock, paper, paper scissors. scissors. On mine. Uh, no, on mine. 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 No matter how you do it, crime doesn't pay girls. Home alone on my birthday. What would complete this depressing scenario better than watching TV? Tomorrow, one day only, Crazy Mookies will be open 24 hours. Can you imagine, you Isis, save, save, buying save diamonds? And Baroness Le Bourget is throwing her annual birthday charity bash this evening. Everyone's wondering if she'll be wearing the emerald-encrusted jewel of the Empress necklace, valued at over one million dollars. Mmm, sounds like our kind of birthday party, eh, Isis? Take the elevator to the 14th floor. Party's just getting on the way. Thanks for the tip, pal. But I think I'll skip the elevator. <laughs> Party on, folks. You're not the jewel of the Empress, but you'll do. And happy birthday to me. <laughs> Where did you come from? Come on, sweetheart. Shh. It's all right. Bad dream. We'll just get you back to bed before someone hears. Il faut trouver mon bijou. Bijou? Bijou. I don't remember much French, but that word means jewel, doesn't it? Bijou? Yes. Show me bijou. Bijou est là, et les autres. Bijou. Autre? Et les autres. Bijou, the jewel of the empress and others. You bet I'll add AU. They must have left the safe open. You crawled inside and got locked in. Could have suffocated, poor babies. Oh, merci, madame. Joyeux anniversaire. Oh, happy birthday to us all, sweetheart. A very, very happy birthday.
I've got a job for you, girl. Now, I don't want to have to go looking for you like last time. I mean it, Harl. Stay here and don't move, no matter what. Wakey, wakey, Mr. Mayor. Wakey, wakey. Huh? Uh, security! Help! 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 I gave them all a little goodnight kiss. What? What do you want? Only what you promised in your election campaign. That you would never sell off or develop any of Gotham's parks, gardens, or open lands. I'm not selling off- LIAR! A city council proposal to use the city wetlands for a mega outlet mall. Veto the bill. It'll cost jobs. It'll cost votes, you mean. Do I need to squeeze it out of you? Stop! Outside! Outside! There. I did what you wanted. Now let me go. I need an assurance that you won't simply change your mind. I give you my word. Ha! The word of a politician. Plant spores. I call them Pinocchio variants. Very sensitive to the minute changes in human blood chemistry, body temperature, and skin impulses that take place when someone lies. Well, I wasn't lying. Oh! Pinocchio says you were. Oh! And now you'll never lie to anyone again, right? And in a stunning reversal after vetoing the council's Parks and Recreation Redevelopment Bill, the mayor resigned, citing a health condition which no longer allows me to continue in my chosen profession of politics. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> What? I'm bored. Take a cat nap. I can't. Then bother Ivy. Tell me a story. Jack and the Beanstalk. I hate that story. Rife with plant abuse. Sleeping Beauty? Apple abuse. Princess and the Pea? I know, pea abuse. Goldilocks? This is the story of Goldilocks. But no bears. I hate bears, P.U. Great. Goldilocks and the three babes. One day they went for a walk while their breakfast cooled. While they were gone, who should break in but... Goldilocks? Yeah. Only this one has pointy ears and a black cowl. The greedy little thing was so hungry, she sat down at the three babes' table and started to eat their food. First, she had a scoop of Catwoman's food, but it was too fishy. Blech. Then she tried Ivy's food, huh? but it was Ugh, too leafy. Then she tried a spoonful of Harley's food, and it was just right. Goldilocks decided to rest, so she tried Catwoman's chair, but it was too high. She tried Ivy's chair, but it was too weird. Then she tried Harley's chair. Just right. She was...
was so exhausted, she decided to lie down and take a nap. She tried Catwoman's bed, but it was too soft, yada yada. Too hard, yada yada. Just right, yada yada. Cut to the chase, woman. And the three babes arrived home to find... Someone's been sleeping in my bed. And there she is! Oops. They chased the interloper away, and they never saw her again. Ah, I love a happy ending. Don't you? This one's just right. Harley girl, important errand. I'll be gone for a few days. Please water the plants. All except for the mamisha. Don't water it. Don't touch it. Don't even look at it. Like I didn't already know that. Sheesh! Drink up, fellas! Don't water it. Don't touch it. Don't even look at it. <gasps> Phew! That was close. Hey! Ow! Ew! Aw, how cute! The hard way or the easy way. Up to you. I don't even want to know. So? So, she used a pie. A pie. Oh, what kind? I think it was a meringue of some sort, or maybe lemon, or... It doesn't matter. Pie is my M.O. <laughs> <laughs> that gets me every time. That woman has got to be stopped. I agree. Last week, she stole the cat's paw opal. That jewel was mine to steal. And setting the cloister woods fire to create a distraction. I can't imagine you're too happy about that. I'm not, but she's not exactly in the yellow pages. I've got a lead, but I'm going to need some help. We're with you, Whiskers. She works out Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at the Tower Top Gym. I hate these modern buildings. Not a single handhold. I thought you could climb anything. That's why I brought you along. Shall we? She's in there. You sure? I tracked her through her locker ID. <laughs> gotcha! Back 
girl? Harley? Ivy? 